Hey guys, so welcome to the tutorial. This tutorial is about advanced divider wizard. In this tutorial, you will be able to know about divider. And I will show you how you can do that using advanced divider wizard. Here I have taken heading and paragraph B4. Now I will show you how you can set divider between heading and paragraph. Go to Elementor dashboard. I'm going to Elementor dashboard and selecting advanced divider. I'm inserting advanced divider between heading and paragraph. This is a default divider. Go to select divider. You will find 15 plus divider. You have to check them all. Come to alignment controls. From here you can set the alignment of divider. Left, right or center. maximum width controls it will allow you to set maximum width there is options for you to set gap top and bottom just scroll The important thing is animations. If you want a divider to animate, you have to check or uncheck the animations button. If you uncheck animations button, you will see divider is not animating. If you check the animation button again, you will see the animations again with every single divider here is another controls loop to explain the work of loop before i have taken some sections to explain the activity of loop if you check the loop button you will see after scrolling the mouse from top to bottom you will find every single you will find every single divider with animation. Now come to additional settings sections. From here you can set the stroke width of the divider. If you need to crop the divider, you can do that just using divider crop. From here, you can also set the max match height of divider. Now come to style tab to advance divider. From these sections, you can set style to the divider. You can set color of divider. If you need to set line cap, you can do that. And you can set square, rounded, or bot. There is options offset. If you set the positions of divider, you can do that using offset controls. And that's all about advanced divider visit. Hope you have enjoyed the tutorials and thanks for watching.